Hello and welcome to some more gaming fans. I'm your host Joe Zamora here. What's up, Betty? Bringing you another episode of Pokemon Platinum here. And today we're actually going to get to fight Crash Awake and uh, delve a little bit into the story as well. So be prepared for that. We've got a bunch of Team Galactic stuff to go over. But welcome, welcome back, everybody. We haven't streamed since Friday, so how are y'all doing? I am doing fantastic, other than endless rain here in Texas for the last three weeks. Been doing really, really good. Whew. Clean up my glasses real quick, sorry. And uh, trying to get everyone up to level 37. They've only had two more Pokemon to go. Oh, look at this! Evolution on screen, baby. And now, for our Gen 4 appearance. We finally have Natsu the Charizard. <laughs> Hell yeah, man, that's what I'm talking about. So we finally have Charizard. Beautiful. It's so beautiful. No, no wing attack. We're just gonna teach the fly anyway. Now, at least we are one step closer there. So pretty much everyone on our team is evolved except for Bell, of course, which will be evolved soon. And Sharknado. Not that he needs to be evolved, he's already a beast. Alright, so let's see. What move do we get rid of? Uh, let's get rid of Dragon Rage. I feel like we're so late game already. It's not even useful anymore. Maybe for only catching Mons, really. But we have other Pokemon to do that. So let's go ahead and keep up the grind of Alakazam. Which I think we need to go heal up, really, because we need to get those, uh... What do you call it? We need to get some PP for our psych, our psychic type move. But so far, like I said, very good week. Fantastic. I haven't been drinking soda that much. Um, every now and then. Today it was like the first day I drank soda since Saturday. So. Cutting back on that. Still haven't been to the gym. Really feel lazy. I keep waking up so late. It's like my body needs so much sleep. But then again, it doesn't help going to sleep late either. I think I'm going to try to go to sleep before 2 o'clock tonight. Because <laughs> I've been staying up late. Whoa! It wasn't raining that hard before. Now it's pouring. So yeah, lack of sleep is wild. And it's not like I'm, I have lack of sleep. I sleep from like two to like one. I feel like that's oversleeping. But, you know, slowly but surely, I guess my sleep will get back on track. I just got to start sleeping earlier. But you know, um, it's weird because you'll be at a moment where you're like, oh yeah, I'm tired. I want to go to sleep early. And that moment you feel that it's early, early, like way too early to go to sleep, like eight o'clock. And you're like, I can't go to sleep right now, dude. It's too early. Then you feel like you're going to wake up way too early. So it's just like, Ugh. all right, well, I'm going to stay up a little bit. And then you get your second wind, and before you know it, it's already midnight. And you're like, well, fuck, I already stood up this late. Might as well watch another two episodes or finish this level or something. And you end up going to sleep at 2 o'clock in the morning. So that's my struggles lately. First world problems, am I right? And also, 
another problem I'm having right now is not having a uh, the level up uh, code working in this game. So uh, uh, the the amount of times you gotta battle these Pokemon to get the levels you need, and I gotta be honest, really surprised. Even though you know full odd shinies, I have not gotten one. It's like just. I'll take one. I'll take a shiny. I'll take a shiny shallows. Ugh. I just ate tacos too now. And, and plus drinking a soda after not drinking soda for so long, get gassy. I have to take a gas pill. Who knows? And they work. They're not like, uh, anything special they're just some walgreens gas pills but oh lifesaver man because the uh, gas is no fun it makes you feel like you're overfilled like a balloon ready to pop oh so, yeah guys sorry if it's a little TMI, but I don't really have much else to talk about other than, you know, my gas problems and what I ate and what I'm doing lately. Like, I even have, I, I've been trying to cut back on Cheetos, too. Cheeto, oh my god. I think I ate Cheetos on Friday night, last time I ate chips. And granted, not that long ago, but you know, I'm a chip addict. Well, you don't know that. But now you know. I'm a chip addict. I I like to eat chips every day. I don't. I'm not saying I eat a whole bag all the time every day. But you know, I I do eat like you know a good handful of chips a day. Like I'll have a bag of hot chips. It'll last like the two the big three dollar bag. It'll last me about two or three days, depending. And then I would buy myself more chips. And then it's just like, dude, you can't do that. But I did. And oh my god. Now that. Like I eat lunch. Most of the time. Like no, most of the time. It's just like lunch and dinner only. For me. Because obviously I'm waking up too fucking late. And I'll eat lunch. Like around 2 or 3. And then. I'll eat dinner like at. 8 or 9. Which is completely ridiculous. You should never eat that late. But I do. I forgot where I was going with all this. At the end of the day, I need to get my sleep schedule on track so I can start losing weight because whew, that's just the goal I'm having. And just saying it's not enough. I gotta do it. Let's see here. Quagsire. <sighs> but yeah, guys, comment in the chat. Let me know. How are y'all doing? What time do y'all go to sleep and wake up? <laughs> Maybe I can adopt somebody's habits. Anyone run, anyone run 10 miles a day? I used to run 6 miles a day in high school. I was peak performance back then. Not anymore. Oh yeah, and don't forget to share uh, my stream uh, anywhere you can. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitter. I have a Twitter account, I have a Facebook account. Add me. If you have it. It'll show you it'll tell you whenever I go live. Well, Facebook more than anything, but Yeah. And this is a grind right here.
And um, I'm over here looking at Twitch right now. And it says I broke 505 views. Like, is that just like total? Like even like the quick views, like someone just clicks on my thing and goes away? Or is it like, through all my streams, I only have 505 views total. Interesting. I wonder how that works. How does Twitch determine? I'll never know. But we are at 64 followers. Once we get to 100 followers, I will be doing a giveaway of plushies on the Zamora Gaming Facebook. So, be ready for that. Good news is we're almost done grinding. Sean is almost level 36, which means Charizard should almost be level 37. Cause they split the they split the XP right down the middle pretty much. Only thing is I don't fully know what um what EXP levels they have though. How far, how, how much EXP Charizard needs compared to Sean here. So Charizard needs double of what Sean has. So I'm going to go ahead and work my way down this way so I can go heal again. Because if I'm correct, we are running low on Psy Waves. Oh, Psy Beam. We're out. So perfect a timing. Let's go. Also, guys, I am. I'm on my way to making my own Pokemon game. Well, not Pokemon. I am making my own Fakemon game. And uh, it's going to be interesting, to say the least. Uh, I plan on doing it based on Texas. I am from Texas. And I've always wanted them to have a Texas region. Um, but... They, Pokemon ain't, ain't nowhere near that yet, I don't think. I think they're gonna uh, insert other parts of the world before they get to Texas. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take the initiative on that one. I already got starters in mind, uh, Route 1 encounters. I just don't have names for them yet. And uh, I know the final forms of my starters, but I don't know how to. How I'm going to uh, soup them up, you know, get them from baby form to big form. It's gonna be a challenge. It's gonna be interesting, but uh, I think my Pokemon are gonna be a, a little overpowered. But it, it'll be pretty balanced, I think. I don't think I'm going to have anything that's non-competitively viable. Everything's going to be able to be used. Like, uh... Even the early bugs. I think... I'll, I'll have their stats a little more buffed than... 
how Pokemon originally does it to where, oh yeah, Butterfree and Beedrill are great for the first two, three gems, but after that, uh, catch you a Pinsir or a Scyther or something. <clears throat> and the weird thing is, they have it set up like that, but you can't get Pinsir or Scyther until like the fifth, fifth gym. Technically, you get a little bit before, but you gotta bypass a bunch of routes and go straight to the Safari Zone. But yeah, I'm certainly gonna start talking more about uh, my Fakemon game uh, once um, I actually get some art for it and uh, find out if I can find some developers who actually want to help me out. <clears throat> and set it up. Get it started. And um obviously it'll be a free game for anyone to use. I won't I'm not gonna charge it. It's that's that be ridiculous. One is it's gonna be a technical Pokemon game, and two, I don't wanna get sued. I mean, it's not going to be Pokemon game called it, but, you know, it's going to be obvious that it is one. So, rather avoid that whole conflict. But, um, I don't plan on putting in any old Pokemon in the game. Not even Charizard! So, everything will be original idea it won't be uh reskinned regional mons or anything like that because uh, uh this is not a good idea i don't think and uh i think the game will have a total probably about 120 to 150 pokemon depending on how i can get it to work in i don't i don't really think uh we i need to do too many uh three part Pokemon I think I can pretty much do two parts or one part I mean other than the starters of course but um certainly have the idea in mind of how I want to do it Sorry for that gross sound. I think it's the soda. I don't think I could drink soda anymore. Something, something wrong with me. Old age, maybe. Let's just fuck. Why me? Fast acting, so I should feel better in a second. But Sean is already level 36. Charizard should be level 37 here soon. Boom! Perfect, as I say it. So now we can finally take the EXP share off Natsu. And Sean can get to level 37 that much quicker.
And I know I still have that box there from my uh, my my camera, and I haven't been using it. But trust me, uh, I I'm not camera ready. So no, thank you. Man, with Sean being like 13 levels above, you think I'd be one shot in these cellos, but nope. Not happening. There we go, finally. I could you do that on the last one? You know, I noticed um, a bunch of Nuzlockers are starting to do level caps for their Nuzlocke challenges. Certainly interesting. I never noticed anyone do that before. Then I started doing it. Must be me. <laughs> Just kidding. I doubt it. I'm sure they had their original thought on their own. I never really watched too many Nuzlockers. I pretty much only watched one and he got in trouble. So he doesn't do Nuzlocks anymore. Let's go, Sean. Let's go, Sean. Knock it out, knock it out, knock it out. Ooh, critical hit. We've been getting a lot of those in our favor, so hopefully that doesn't come back to bite us in the ass. Alright, shallows, shallows, get ready to die for my game. Sorry. What in the hell? Have y'all have y'all uh, been paying attention lately? The uh, Samsung girl, not a real girl, it's uh, art. But all the weeds are all over it already. <laughs> wow. Well, and all the people are into it. Yo, Eddie, since you subscribed for the second month in a row, I think, unless you canceled it, I'm not sure. Uh, did it get you uh, another uh, emoji that you're able to use? Because I'm not sure how you unlock the other tiers. It's weird. I didn't set that. But you have to put like tier one emoji, tier two emoji, tier three. Huh. I can't wait till I get some tier three people though, so we can get that bullshit emoji going when bullshit is happening. Also, guys, the reason I shortened my uh, stream week, just in case anyone was wondering, uh, I'm only going to be streaming Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. For one, uh, I don't know, it was kind of hurting my viewership trying to stream every day, and most days I only had like uh, two viewers, which were one was my wife all the time, and uh, another one was my 
view itself. Um, but other than that. Uh, Eddie's always here though, so I appreciate that. Thank you, Eddie, for your support. But man, there was that one week when we were doing great. We had like six, seven people every day. That was nice. Also had good conversation in the chat too. So. More please. Now I gotta nickname these Pokemon by myself, and I am clearly not creative. They're delicious. <laughs> oh, and by the way, Eddie, I was gonna, when I had to replay and catch another another Quagsire. I was going to nickname it Derpalicious, but it didn't fit. So I just had to name it Derp. 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 Ah, one more. One more battle. Hopefully just one more battle, because I'm ready to fight the gym leader. It's been way too long. It certainly feels longer too, because I only I only streamed this playthrough once last week. Sadly. Wednesday we did the draft recap, and then Friday I... After streaming on Tuesday, we forgot to save, so I had to redo all everything we did on Tuesday. So Friday, we just did some battles and whatnot. I kind of want to play Smash this Friday night, and if anyone wants to join me. Friday night Smash Down. I call dibs on Thomas. Dibsies! Yeah, what am I doing? Eh, habits die hard. Alright guys, let's go ahead and get our team back over there so we can start battling Crasher Wait. Wally and obviously Bell is our other answer to this water type gym. Let's go ahead and get this started. Oh shit, I Drowning, I'm drowning! Oh no, not that one. Can I get a honey? Oh yeah. 
see how they try to trick you. Like, oh, yeah, put the button. Yeah, nah, go further down. It's okay, though. Because we already battled all these people. And away we go to crash her way. Welcome. I don't get challenged very often. The glory you are now beholding is Pastoria's gym leader. That's right, I'm Crash Awake. My Pokemon were toughened up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Ha <laughs> ha! The Undertow. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it to line. Alright, Crash Awake. Since you want to be all. Uh, what's it called? Cinematic? I guess. Oh, shoot. He only has three Pokemon? Why was I worried? Uh oh. Gyarados, level 33. Intimidate cuts Wally's attack in half. But Wally is a special attacker and shoots off a quick shock wave. Shockwave is four times effective on Gyarados and takes it down. Gyarados is out. Down on the word go! Floatzel's coming in and it's a very scary Pokemon as well. But Wally will stay in. Floatzel's level 37. And let's see what Wally decides to do. Floatzel goes first with the speediness and goes for a crunch, which is very super effective on Wally. Almost takes it out. Takes it all the way down to 25. Shockwave, though, comes off. Also super effective on the Floatzel. And let's see how much damage this does. Oh, it lives on a sliver of health. But it takes in a berry as well to gain some HP back. All right, what will Joe decide to do here? Ah, uh, we gotta heal. And Wally drinks the Moo Moo milk. Lolto is sitting there, seeing what he's about to do. And Floltzo goes for the Aqua Jet here. All right. I was worried about the pursuit, but we didn't have to worry about it, I guess. Um, let's go ahead and go to Bell here. Wally is switched out as Floatzel remains at a quarter health. Bell decides to come in and Floatzel goes for the crunch once more. Oh, that was not a good idea. Crunch does over half and now Joe has to make a decision here. Super Potion on Bell, please and thank you. This Floatzel is being a problem with its speed and the ability to crunch everything in sight. Oh, and it lowers Bell's defenses here. All right, so we're going to have to do something right now. Bell is switched out and Floatzel is still there at a quarter health, but wrecking havoc as it goes for another crunch. Dawn takes that much better, though. And um, let's see what happens here. Floatzel goes for another crunch. Gets it just under half. And Dawn goes for a water pulse here. Will it be enough? No, it's not. Floatzel is now in the red. And of course, Leader Wake uses a hyper potion. Dawn goes for the mud bomb here. Stab and does a little bit more than water pulse did. But not enough. Looks about to be a third damage. And now Don is looking weary in front of this floats over here. So Joe goes ahead and goes for a Moo Moo Milk. While Floatzel is much better in health now that it got that Hyper Potion. Floatzel's going for Brine. Ooh, that doubles its attack whenever your opponent is under half health. So that could have been some major damage there. Lucky for the heal, it wasn't. Oh, but the but the bell, the the scarf, the the the, the quick claw pops. Oh, it gets a critical hit as well. Oh my goodness, Gastrodon takes Floatzel down. 
with the combination of the quick claw pop and the critical hit, they were able to take him down no problem. And now Quagsire is coming out. Assuming a switch to Bell is coming, and yes it is! Alright, Bell, this is what you have been prepping on all game, all game. Groundwater types are what you destroy. Bell goes for the Gug Drain, of course being faster than a Quagsire. Can it take it out? It does! Four times effective Grass type and getting all the way back to full. Bell gets some beefy XP and defeats Leader Wake. <laughs> it's gone and ended. How will I say it? I want more! I want to battle more! I should have had six Pokemon. It seems the Undertow pulled me under. But I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. You received the Fin Badge. Oh, Fin with F-E-N. Huh. You need that Fin Badge to use the hidden move Surf outside of battle. This is a special reward for me in recognition of your team. Uh oh, here we go, here we go. Uh -oh. TM55 Brine doubles the attack stat if, well, doubles the attack power if your opponent's below half. So thank you, come again. I need Surf now. <coughs> oh, hey, you got the gym badge here, huh? Why'd I tell you? What'd I tell you? Mr. Wake, I mean, the master, is pretty awesome, huh? Watch this racket, then. Oh, it's you two. Oh, master! Listen, kid, I know your father. I won't deny that. But I don't recall ever taking you on as an apprentice, not in the least. Besides, you two don't need me. You can become strong on your own without being my apprentice. It doesn't matter. I made you my master, I decided. But forget that, there's trouble brewing. There's a Team Galactic goon in front of the observation gate. He said something about using a bomb. What? No one messes with Pastoria, not on my watch. Hey, master, wait. Yeah, good job, Eddie, we don't fuck it up. Could've stopped the Team Galactic guy yourself. No, well, we're gonna go ahead Heal up our team real quick, because it is much needed. For a second there, I thought that Floatzel was going to give us a real problem. Alright, let's go ahead and lead Natsu here. Because we need to get Charizard some screen time. Hey, look, it's Barry. Does my new outfit look good or what? Krogog's where it's at. Alright, crazy ass dude. Hey, what am I, chopped liver? Don't forget, I'm here too. So, where is this galactic... <laughs> <laughs> that was rough. You! What have you done? What have I done? You're asking. Well, technically speaking, it wasn't me. The package that arrived, see. That was a bomb. Named the Galactic Bomb. Me, I was told to push the button, so I did, like, quink. Oh, that's right. Mustn't forget, the test results need reporting. Cheerio, then, you daft codiger. Your masks is absurd. The Great Marsh is unavailable, invaluable, invaluable. You too, do not follow me. Don't let anyone else in there either. There'd be the big, there'd be big trouble if there's any of that boom left. Hey Joe, you go after the Galactic Goon. I'm gonna stay here like Master said. Got to keep others from going in. Don't let the Galactic guy get away. Yeah, sure. Send me on the fucking goose chase. What's with you? Stop chasing after me, you! I have half a mind to pulverize you with my Pokemon. But like I said, 
I have to be on my way to the lake ASAP. So, sorry you're out of luck. I'm out. Alright. Do I make myself clear? Don't you dare follow me. We're gonna follow you anyway. We need the energy from the valley woodwork to make this. It would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss, who made this, is a scientific mechanical genius. You were eavesdropping. I was just thinking out loud. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Alright, so I guess we continue to follow the blue-headed imbecile. Boy, that galactic bomb backs a pretty big wall. With that baby here, there's not much we can blow. We can't blow up. I wonder what they have planned for this. <coughs> you eavesdropping again? I was just thinking out loud. You're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away, but I am not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Oh shit! Scared the shit out of me. Hello, my friend. The cargo. That the Team Galactic brought is worrisome. So I have come. You say the cargo. It was a bomb. And there was an explosion? The explosion was at the Great Mars? Furthermore, are you pursuing a man? A man with a funny bowl cut haircut. In an outfit that is very strange? In other words, that is the Team Galactic. Oh no no no. How did I miss it? Ah, look her. This time, you have made a mistake of the ages. The man who I have seen running away, he was the bearer of the bomb. Ah, this will not do. Wait, wait, I say. Okay. Ah, my friend, it's you. Yeah, I am at the hotel now. I am interviewing people to see if they have seen anyone suspicious. I would like your assistance. Go search outside if you will. The suspect, he may have already slipped away ahead unnoticed. Look, you're, you're pathetic. You're a pathetic loser. Oh, look, here you are. Why am I running away like this? The new world, the new universe that our boss was talking about. This, this makes me giddy thinking about it. When we use this thing, oh shit, yeah, you're eavesdropping, I was only talking to myself, you're persistent too, I'm pooped out from all the running, but I'm not going to battle, oh you're gonna battle me, son of a bitch, ah no, you're still on my tail, the lake's within sight, you leave me no choice, but my Pokemon will KO you, Wow, one Pokemon? You think that's gonna be enough? Wow. That was pathetic. First Fire Fang Charizard, you missed. <coughs> what? It lived on like half health. Like 0.27 HP. What the fuck is that? Hey, right, not too. Come on, you're smarter than this. Hell yeah! Yeah, if I didn't run, I wouldn't be so tired. I can't battle anymore. I'm running on fumes. I have to give this to Commander. I wish I got to use this at the lake. Oh, great. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How's your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but, well, it doesn't appear to be open to the public right now. Have you ever heard of the folklore about it? They say there is an island inside the lake. And inside that island is a mirage of a Pokemon. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Oh, that's right. I had to talk to you about something else. 
Hey, Joe, where'd the galactic dude run off to? Huh? Is this your old sister? No, she isn't. Oh, okay. Uh, the explosion at the Great Marsh, it, was anything ser it wasn't anything serious. Mr. Wake told me to tell you that. But the Team Galactic, wow, are they out of control or what? Next time I see them, I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. See you around. Jesus. He's your friend? He's more impatient than he is energetic, isn't he? So, getting back to what I started saying earlier. Have you seen the group of Psyduck on Route 210? Yes. Yes, that's right. By the cafe on Route 210. You've seen that group of Psyduck cuddled with their heads, with their heads in their uh, hand? Up their ass. Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on the side up. You're working on a Pokedex, so it would be worthwhile for you. Can I get served too? Joe put the secret potion in the key items. I went on a big adventure with Pokedex when I was younger. I hope you get to meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Pokemon. See you later. So when do I get served? I mean, I'm already five badges in. Time to earn my badges. Bitch. Is this necessary? No, but I'm doing it anyway. I gotta do it with the mouse. I wonder how long they stay clean for, because I just cleaned them like the last time I did this. Get it! Get it! Get it! Ah! <laughs> Driving you crazy. Driving me crazy. It's okay. One badge to go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Cling, 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 cling. There we go. Boom. Shiny. Everything is clean. So yeah, we're five bet badges in. I wonder when we get surf. But I guess the only thing we can do now is go this way. get rock slide rock climb soon because we're gonna need it to get the shiny stone oh shit we gotta get all right hold on hold on well the side ducks are finally gone whoa you went the wrong way buddy oh my gosh oh good you used the secret potion i gave you pokemon are known to suffer from chronic headaches but no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh yes, can I ask you a big favor? I want to. I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there are some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so I know it'll be worth your while. Here's an old charm. Can you give me, sir? My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yes, I'm sure you'll. You will. You will. A little. She's an elder of Selected Town. And the location, look at your town map. You can't miss it. 
It's okay, I'm counting on you. See you down the road. Whatever. I gotta go get a defog Pokemon though, because I'm not dealing with the accuracy drops. <clears throat> All right, what Pokemon can we s let sit back and relax? Um, you know what? Let's go. No, Let's go ahead and leave Alakazam back for the time being. Alright, so let's see the next gym. Pokemon Platinum. The next gym is level 41, the max. So we won't go over level 41. Deal? Deal. And the Ranger game is on tonight, too. Texas Rangers, not New York, whatever. Alright, this is still Route 210, so no encounter yet. I mean, technically it's a new area, so we could count it as an encounter. Uh, we'll see. Let's see what's in here first. Caribia! You know what? I'm not gonna count it as a new encounter. Too much waste of time. Repel! Ooh, Max Repel. That'll help. Ching ching! Nothing. Nothing. What the hell? All these bald patches and no, no, uh, random, no random item. Oh. Different grass, eh, Mon? I'm assuming. Here, dude. I already have one of you. Don't be pathetic, you bastard. Yep, this is what I'm talking about right here. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead defog now. So our battles can be uninterrupted by accuracy drops. Honey tree. I just startled you. Oh, you're still struggling to recover. I'm gonna battle you. Okay. Okay, buddy. Your strategy's not gonna help you though. Especially with weak ass Zubat. This is the thing I don't ever get. Like, why do they have such low level Pokemon when we just faced a gym leader with level 37? You get real. Alright, go back time. Fire Fang, let's go, let's do this. Do that, do that. Go Tiger, ooh, burn. 
Why are you so weak, Natsu? Like, what's your problem, dude? Your adamant nature. You got attacking moves. Great. Now we're now we're confused. Dang, his special attack is still higher. Wild. So let's go to Wally here because I don't want to deal with confused shenanigans. Wing attack. And now you're dead. Wow. It would live on one. Scruppy, which is perfect for Natsu. Let's send Natsu back out now that he's not confused. Jesus Christ. He's got happy feet over here. Down goes Scruppy. Scruppy is now gone. Next up is Stunky, and we'll destroy that thing. Two. Hmm, hate to see it. Is it still Route 210? I think it is. But I guess I'll catch this hoot hoot since uh, it is a, a, a Pokemon I don't have and I consider this area a new route, I guess. Or we'll just kill it. Red shard. That could be useful. Need to find some more shards. <clears throat> As an ace trainer, I have to ask. I have to take battles in stride. I need to stay cool and calm, whether I win or lose. Good luck there. Apom use water poles? What the fuck kind of apom do you have? Get that shit out of here. Critical hit. I would have been salty as fuck if an apom water pole sprit knocked me out. Alright, time to fire fang your ass. Almost. And now it got a curse up. Lost attack. Lost defense. But I ain't gonna save you now. Bye bye, Grottle. Alright, level 38. Rapperig. Let's go ahead and go Sharknado here. Dragon Claw time. So Giraffe Ray goes down. Critical hit. Thank you for giving me one in return. And now we'll work on getting Sharknado up a level. Try to keep it as even as possible. Oh. 
Yo. This music lit, yo. Not lit, Leo, but lit, yo. Jen, watch this. I'm going to use everything you've taught me. Here comes the trainer, Zach. You ready? Let's do this. I don't I don't want to know about y'all's kinky sexual position. So keep that to yourself. Oh shit. We got a Raichu, a Gyarados. This is not good because if it has Ice Fang, that could be a problem. So I am going to go ahead, uh, switch out, go straight to Dawn, and I am going to use Stun Spore on Gyarados. Alright, so Tell Whip is going to bring our defense down, which is not good. Gyarados goes for Ice Fang, so thank goodness I made the switch. Don lives it, no problem. <laughs> Why'd you miss your Stun Spore? Alright, so we got... We're gonna go for the Stun Spore again. And we're going for Mud Bomb on the Raichu. Okay, Twister is not looking handle. There we go. Get that nice stun spore off. Don flinch, of course. Let's go for the mud bomb again. And do they have more Pokemon? No. So we're just gonna go for the uh, Giga Drain here on the right too as well. Quick claw pops off, so that's useful. Kill this thing. Flat out kill it. Does not. Goes for another tail whip. So if uh, Gyarados goes for Ice Fang and a Bell. That's pretty bad. I just thought about that. I don't know why I didn't switch that out sooner. Oh no. It's, it's dead. There's no way it's not. Fuck! Well. Uh, Bell's Redemption did not last long. Oh my gosh, that's that's a lightning fucking Pokemon, isn't it? I'm gonna go for the hidden power, and I'm gonna go Shockwave on Gyarados. Okay, Whew. thank goodness it was not lightning rod. Which makes me feel foolish, because I could have done that sooner. But, you know, it is what it is. We lost Bell again. But at least this stupid battle's over, and we can go switch out Bell for the Alakazam real quick. And leaves us open for a grass type once again. Game. Fuck it, you stupid game. Fuck you, you stupid game. Oh, look at that. There's people to battle in here. Well, I don't think we're gonna get another redemption for Roserade anytime soon, so. Oh, well. Fuck off, Sucker Punch. Okay, let's see Earthquake again. No Sucker Punch this time.
Alright, well, let's hurry up and uh, get the fuck out of this grass. Again, doomed for all of eternity. Late to rest, our little princess. Bell. It's a bell. and take an ass. Alright, Defog, do your job. I would have rather lost Gash Gun. We could have got... We had Spikes Iron in the back. Placement grass type lock. I need rock climb. I need rock climb. You know, right there, I think that's where uh, the shiny stone is. Just right off that little fucking rock climb thing. Bastard. Alright, Dragon Claw. You thought I was gonna switch. Dragon Claw gonna do the damn thing, boy. Ooh, Luxio, welcome to the party. Welcome to the earthquake party. Ain't no party like an earthquake party because an earthquake party don't stop. Robo pass. Earthquake again, baby. I had to think about this one too, because I was like, does Pro Pass have levitate? I was like, no, it doesn't. Certainly can't live no earthquake from a shark native. Oh. Whoop, there it is. Hyper Potion time! Wait, no, not Hyper Potion. Um, Moo Moo Milk! Get that Mommy Milkers out here! Regular Potion for Charizard. Duh. There we go. Go ahead and put Wally up front. Get you level 38 next. Next. This buff physique isn't just for show. Oh, yeah? What the Thor? What joke? 
is out to play. We're just gonna go for Shockwave, yeah. He's gonna have to waste a turn and go for Foresight or something. Oh, you're just dumb. One final shockwave for the road. Alright, well, he's already level 38. That was easy. Easy, but That was easy. Alright, time to go Sean here. I assume we have a ninja battle next. Ninja battle now next. We ninjas appear where you least expect us. Nah, I, it's pretty obvious where you're at. Oh shit, it's dark type. gonna kill me isn't it <laughs> don't kill me thank you I'm really hoping to go suit and it didn't so we take those time to go for a good old-fashioned mud bomb muddy 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 bombs So we have Golbat coming in next. Sean should be able to take care of that. Should be. Right. Side beam, do your thing. goes go back I didn't expect to lose oh, you expect it son my show not yours I'm the hero in this story never be too sure A ninja can use all kinds of skills like this and like that and like this and a, and like this and like that and like that and a, like this and near 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 Why are you a ninja with a bug type Pokemon? What is the matter with you? Fucking idiot! Alright, looks like we're going to down. Energy ball! Typing. Okay. Ooh. Makes me feel so much better. Alright, now we can go for Hidden Power Rock. And down it goes! Don and Sean are making. This sounds like a freaking sitcom. Don and Sean. Yeah, I'll smash it later. Waterfalls that you can't go up. Useless. I'll teach you about the charms of bird Pokemon. Oh, will you? I'll teach you how much I don't care about bird Pokemon. Hoot hoot! Who that? Me that. I'm 
Almost took it out with one hit. Tal's turn. Come on, side beam, do your thing. Oh no, that's not gonna do. Go to Don. Time to hidden power rock. Super effect, but I think a water pulse will do more. Oh, never mind. But at least water pulse to finally take it down. Alright, let's see here. Good, we finally beat her. Now let's get some health back on our Pokemon. Moo Moo Milks. Need that milky. Okoiki. How the hell are you supposed to get that item? Where can you? Oh, I think I know where. Okay. So that makes somewhat sense now. Very well, I've decided. I'll battle one last time. With the, with you, then I'm retiring as a trainer. I'm about to end this man's whole career. Wow! Alright, so Big Sean. About to take out this angler. Side beam, motherfucker! Yeah! Oh yeah, I took it out. Sweet. That should be a level, and it is. All right, so we got Weasel coming in. Let's go ahead and go to Don. Yeah! You got this. Let's go, Don. Get the Don. Should have been water absorb or storm drain or something. Hidden power. Don't want to miss. How did he miss? Use aqua jet. Oh, I lowered his accuracy. Makes sense. All right, Ponyta, time. Uh, uh, I mean, Don, come take out this Ponyta and get that level. Nami, Nami. Mean, I mean. Water, oh, 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 oh. And down it goes. Looking mighty fine, fine as wine, having ourselves a big and rich time. It was just about as far as she let me go. Alright, well, we did that. Give me that citrus berry. Oh yeah, yeah, that citrus berry. I need that 
sisters fairy. Look at that, just a fairy. I'm quite fairy. All right, I'm gonna plant a bunch. Plant berry. I'm gonna plant as many citrus berries as possible. again tomorrow. Route 210 was long. And now we never have to go through Route 210 again. Go check out the cave painting, so I will. Once uh, I explore the rest of town. Oh look, I got the analog watch. Okay. Dumb. Did you know they say legendary Pokemon made the Sinnoh region? Yeah. We're about to find out some of that stuff when Pokemon Arceus comes out in January 28th. I'm ready for it. I already have it pre ordered. She said something about buying and selling houses. Yeah, good luck with this economy. How many great balls do I have? 19. So I'll buy 20. Well, there's not that many routes left. I'll buy 10. Uh, how many? I'll buy 29. And I'll buy... See what I can sell. I need those. I need a heart skill. I need that, 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 that. Um. Shit, I was trying to sell the magma razor because I don't need that. Um, okay. Don't need that. Don't need those. Or those. Or that. Or these. Oh wait, no. I, I do need those. Just. Eh, I don't need that. Alright. Quick balls. Get thrown away. I mean, great balls. I need quick balls. Don't need the nest ball. I need all my berries. Need all my berries, berries, berries. 
All right, I am good to go. What do you got, geezer? The shell bell the Charizard. Damn it. Uh, give this to Sean. Dark type moon. I don't have any. That's all I can do for now. anymore and again we have no replacement bug type Poke I mean grass type Pokemon um, what do we really want to add to the team though That's the real question <sighs> none of these Pokemon We got psychic, we got ghost, electric, we have ground water, ground dragon, uh, flying fire. Honestly, a dark type would be nice. I don't want Umbreon though. Let's just rock out with our socks out right now. And uh, let's just roll with what we have. I'm gonna catch a Pokemon here. Give me a Dratini. Dratini, Dratini, give me a Dratini. Probably not a Dratini. Goldine, Goldine. Alright, well, we got this useless ass Pokemon. Let's see if we can catch it. Quick ball, go! We got this useless Pokemon. Golding, 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 Yes, let's click name it. Um, let's let's click the little let's click let's nickname it. Lust. Why not? Look at them lips. I bet they're lustful for you. Right, let's go ahead and put them in the box. Already more catchable Pokemon that we've caught in this game than in Heart Gold Soul Silver. Just to give you a comparison of how little you can actually catch in that game.
That gas will not help. Jesus Christ. There's an old spaceman in front of the roofs. There isn't anything there, but that only get, seemed to make him get angry. He said he was going to blow the whole town up with a bomb. That is nerve of it all. If only I were younger, I'd punish that spaceman with my Pokemon. What, are your Pokemon old too? Like, do something, lady? The fuck? Howdy. Shut up in the local history. If I tell you that Mount Coronet, I'll be able to see all of Sinnoh. Maybe. Mount Coronet towers at the center of Sinnoh. In a way, it's the closest place to the sky and to the space in this region. How poetic. Let's see what we got working. A big house with only this much space? My big sister is studying the myths of Sinnoh. She wants to know how people and Pokemon interacted in the days of myths. Were they different back then? Uh, or were they the same as now? She says that's the focus of her research. Tell her to check out when Pokemon Legends Arceus comes out in January 28th. Where are you from? Tunic Town, you said. Isn't that close to Lake Verity? That lake is said to be the home of Mistbrick, the emotion, the being of emotion. The Pokemon may well be watching over you. Well, would you like to know more about Mistbrick now? Maybe someday, but not today. How many times do we got to teach this last day, old man? Ooh, item. Yes, please! Ooh, King's Rock. Let's go ahead and put that on somebody. Get some flinches going. Sharknado, why not? The shrine. Who is it to? Yo, Baba. Ooh, Dragon Fang. That might actually be better. No, flinch. All right, so we'll do this. Um, give Dragon Fang to the Sharknado. King's Rock. The Wally! So now Wally has something to hold on to. This town is insignificant. There's nothing of value here. It doesn't need to exist, so I'll just blow it up with the Galactic Bomb. If you try to mess with me, I'll shut you down with the Pokemon battle. So, what are you gonna be? Are you gonna mess with me? Yes. You dare to oppose Team Galactic? That means you're taking on the world! No, the universe, even! I'm okay with that. I don't know. Oh, this is a bad matchup. Why do we only have one move? Um, let's go ahead and go straight to Sharknado. Let's go ahead and Dragon Claw with our Dragon Fang. Makes no sense. But it boosts our Dragon Claw move. Go that. Alright, now Sean can do something. Ha! Ah, ha! Ah, my foot almost cramped. Ow. That failed. Uh, 
Alright. We defeated him, no problem. Too much to handle. I can't do anything here. This place is nothing. I'll be happy to rid of this place. Oh, you are magnificent, child. Aren't you quite the trainer? As an elder of Celestic Town, I give you my thanks. Oh, that old charm, dearie. Hey, may I see that? What's that? You say Cynthia entrusted you with this to deliver to me? That's Cynthia. She's my granddaughter. The old charm is something made in Celestic Town long ago. It was made in honor of a mythical deity said to have created Sinnoh. These old charms are still discovered now and again. Since you're in Celestic Town, why not look around inside the ruins? <clears throat> Nothing. Mierda. So examine the ancient cave paint. The serious designs cover the whole section of the wall. There are, three, there are three strange things forming a triangle. In the middle of them, a shining sphere. What is this all about? <clears throat> the cave painting meaning seems to be this. Here, there existed beings. Beings so powerful, they were considered deities at a time. There were three Pokemon with the power to match either being. The three kept balanced with either being, as if they formed a pyramid. It's an ancient legend of Sinnoh, and that is still told in Celestic Town. The Illuminati confirmed. I would like to know more about the legend, if you will. Who might you be? My name is Dykes. I want to put an end to the pointless strife and hostility. I am seeking the power to create the ideal world. Thus, I want you to answer. The world today can't change because the, the three Pokemon keep it in balance. Is that what you are saying? I wouldn't know. I do know the world is in balance. I'm quite satisfied with the world the way it is. I am not interested in your question. Plead ignorance, will you? What a pointless attitude. You fail to appreciate the world. It is incomplete. I will change the world. As the first step, I will destroy the cave painting that you've protected all these years. A new legend of a new world should take its place. Am I wrong? I, if you feel that way, challenge me. I know you, trainer. We've met at Mount Coronet. Why would you want to protect this incomplete world? As the boss of Team Galactic, I will show you in the error of your ways. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. This isn't good. I'm gonna get pursuit trapped. Uh, but I gotta. All right, cool. Ooh. <coughs> I forgot this battle happens. But thing. Cyrus goes down! So at least Sneasel does. Golbat's coming in now, and we're gonna go ahead and see Sean. Golbat! Takes the side beam. Can it live it? Probably not. Ooh, and it doesn't. Down it goes. Bro. 
Murkrow is going to come in. And, uh, we'll go not to. You forced my hand this time. Your, your, your team sucks, dude. And as I say that, we miss our fire thing. Damn, that Merkel bulky. It lives a fire thing and it goes for another hit. Alright, um, we're gonna heal. Just in case we miss. Don't want to miss. Fire Fang time. And Murkrow finally goes, what? Bullshit! Why does everything live on like 2 HP? That wasn't 1 HP, that was 0.1 HP. Bullshit ass game. Shit does a lot of damage. Charizard, you struggling on this little bitch ass Murkrow? Fix yourself. Should have had a flamethrower by now. You can't find your wireless headphones? All good, Eddie. At least his attacks don't miss. <laughs> his attacks don't. Don't seem to. Welcome on, welcome all. We are just defeating Cyrus. Remarkable. But Elder, your attitude told me what I needed to know. If the beings of time and space are brought together, they can't be stopped. Such a strange, strange man, spouting such nonsense. The time and space of Sinnoh are filled with the memories and thoughts of countless people in Pokemon. This is a wonderful world. What needed what need is there for it to change? Why can't I A sub not send via sub mode only? I don't know, you should be able to. Well, that's what I was saying. It you you it shows that you subbed, but it also shows that someone unsubbed. Cause I don't have any subs active on my thing right now, so I don't know. It's weird, man. Previously sub for two months. I don't know. That's weird. But I added you as a friend. So. I have to see, I have to see why, I don't know, I don't know how to check it, but I'll Google it and try to figure it out. Because right now it says subscriber zero, sub point zero. But it says you've subbed twice. So I have, 
I, I I honestly don't know. I'd have to try to figure out how to look that up. Let me see. Let me see if I can find it. Channel analytics subscriptions. It says no subs this month. Hold on. Let's see. It said between April, it said April 27th, you paid to be a sub, and I guess it ended at the end of April? That's weird. Why would it do that? weird uh like i said eddie it said uh it you subscribed on the 27th but now it's showing that you're not a subscriber for this month. And I don't know how to fix that if I can. I don't know why I did that because like I said for some reason it shows no sub this month hmm. I'll try to figure out more but if anything I'll pay for your sub this month because that's weird it only let you sub yeah today is the first april May. yeah it says six days ago you you, you subscribe But nowhere else is it showing. That. It shows my last sub was on the 27th. And I haven't had a sub since. So I guess. Maybe it refunded your sub. I'm assuming. Let me know. <laughs> Yeah, damn Twitch. Again, dude, let me know. See if it actually refunded you or something. Because it, it's showing on my end that... Like, on the activity feed, it shows you subscribe. But on the insights and analytics, it's not showing... That anything was charged. So I hope you weren't charged anything. Cause that would that would suck that would make no sense but we finally got served and we can start working our way to the uh, next thing over all right sir on dawn Bye bye, Water Pulse. Finally, a good water type attack move. Easter. Ow. Alright, I'm scratching my back. It itches. Ah!
Oh, there we go. Much better. Okay, let's see. Uh, we got Dawn Surf. We didn't lose anybody in that fight. So let's fly back to Jubilife City. And let's go ahead and leave Sean up front. Why not? Oh, we can go in here and get our Pokinav. Oh yeah, let's try the lottery real quick. No, nope, no match. So I guess it's not this building. I guess it's the next building over. The TV one, right? Ain't this the TV one though? Maybe it's just this one. Ow! Alright, so now I got the memo pad. The marking map. The link searcher, whatever that is. Oh, wireless hotspot. All right. Oh, okay. I can't wait to get the uh, the coin flip one. I like the coin flip app. All right, so we're gonna backtrack just a little bit. There's some things we can do now that we have surfed. One of the first ones is go here. Let's go ahead and get the uh, Max Chappelle going. Interesting boats. What the hell? Level 38 tentacruel. That's nice. Meet side beam. Okay, it's confused. Hurt yourself. Alright, now I'm going to throw a Pokeball, and this counts as my Pastoria City encounter. Woo -woo. Um, the days it shows you sub, the last day it showed you subbed was the 20, April 27th. Stins. It extends its eight, 80 tentacles. Damn, 80 tentacles. Interesting. That does not look like 80 tentacles. Yeah, like I said, man, check it out and let me know what happened. Because, like I said, it doesn't show anything else on my end. Um, I'm going to go good old no name. Yeah, I, it doesn't show anywhere that it says you gift some gifted somebody a sub. Hinty rules. I 
I don't know. I've been gifted a sub. I like I didn't even buy it. Someone paid it for me for somebody that I've never watched before. Maybe that's what happened to you. Because that's happened to me. I don't understand why someone would do that. I guess it's just got disposable income or something, but not me. <laughs> not me, fam. That ain't happening for me. Let's see. Is there anything out here? Interesting. What's this? This is interesting. I wonder what that that's why that's there. The world may never know. <laughs> Same. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Super repel. There we go. Yeah, I bought a hundred of them motherfuckers right there. Whoa. How do I get to that side? Look, there's Pokemon trainers on that side. Bag. Where's the map? I need to see what the hell's going on. It's weird. How, how come there are trainers down there? I never knew this. There's trainers down here. A whole new world. What the fuck could be over here? I'm glad I decided to explore. Holy shit. I never knew this area was here. Hi, wave riding trainer. How about battling on the sea? Okay. I want to see what I'm going to get over here. This is interesting. Hold on to your hats, people. We're up for a wild ride. Zoom around. We're gonna destroy all these Pokemon real quick. I'm intrigued. I want to know what is actually over here. Just trainer, because I mean it helps. I needed uh, I needed some more levels on my Pokemon for the next gym, and I always wondered like it's straight from this gym to that gym. Like how the how the hell are you supposed to get more gym badges? I mean more levels on your Pokemon. Traveling alone, are you? That's impressive. How about we battle? Okay. Okay. I'm I'm just happy to be here. And of course, the Rangers are losing, so that's always a bonus. A whole new world of possibilities that are happening here. Look at Pelipper Deer. I'm gonna destroy it with a shockwave once again. Unless it does that. There we go.
I'll never forget the time a Pelipper got three protects on me and forced me out of Thunderbolts. I was livid! Uh, Ominous win, do your thing, give me the boost, give me the boost, yeah. Stupid boy, when are you gonna learn? I'm a ghost type. Level 39. Pip squeak. Oh, what are you going with pip squeak, little big boy? This way. Go all the way around. Mm, is this a good idea? Is this a good idea? Nope, but let's do it anyway. Okay, cool. God said, don't worry, son, I got you. Hello there, aren't you going to swim? Nope. Do I look like I'm bottom feeder like you? Ooh, penny on. The most worthless Pokemon in Gen 4. Even under Magikarp. Because at least Magikarp evolves into Gyarados. This thing just... Ugh. Disgusting. Down go Pelipper. Those of you just joining us, we're in some new area of Pokemon Heart. I mean, Pokemon Platinum I've never been in. And look at that, another Water Stone. Another Blue Shard would have been nice. Yeah. Burr, I'm starting to get chilly. I could use a wind to get warmed up. Well... Better get one with the loss, because that's what's happening. Golduck is so cool looking, too bad it sucks. Ooh, yell at me, yeah. I got a yelling at fetish. Alright, so we worked our way past the gold duck. And just about another gold duck. What are your guys' favorite water type Pokemon? I don't have one. I don't think. You know what? I lied. It's probably Swampert. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is not my Batman cup. And you need to chill out with those crits. Uh, you're about to catch two left hands and a right hook. Wally like that. What's the matter with you? What's the matter with you, son? Moo Moo Milkers. I need my Moo Moo Milkers. Thank you. Thank you very much. 
needed that. Is there any more dingling, ringling, jingling around here? Nope. No money. No hidden items. Ooh, all that for a big pearl. All right. Go back. We have to go back. You can't fuck your mother, Marty. But Doc! Nope! Ain't happening! Alright. Now that we got our little uh, charade out of the way. How do we... Is there anything else to explore over here? I mean, that was pretty neat. I mean, only benefit was the water stone, but... At least it's a new area. That I've never been to. In all my years of playing this game. Never really explored Platinum. Like I'm doing right now. Okay. So there's this. What's this? Okay. Worthless. Worthless to me. But. Is there a hidden item anywhere? Oh yeah. Oh, another big pro. Okay. I guess that's something, right? What are you waiting for? Something amazing, I guess. I swim the whole year round. I'm not losing a battle at sea. Well, I guess you are. Because if not, that means my Nuzlocke is over. Ooh, big scary Pokemon. Get rid of us. He went round. We'll say hello to my electric type attack move. The big bitch. <sighs> oh, another Gyarados. This man is ready for a battle. He wasn't playing. He's like, I am not losing. I would send out every water-type dragon beast I have. Three Gyaradoses. This man was not playing. He said, I'm going to stock up on the strongest water-type Pokemon. And fade the first person that comes near me. He said, I'm about that life, homie. Ooh. Almost. I lost it. See, but I swim here. Anyways. Whatever he said. Mm -mm. All right, well, we discovered that part, which is cool. Like I said, never, ever tried checking that out before. All right, now, where's another piece of water? Let's fly all the way back. Warburg City, no, no water. Art Home City, no, there's no water. Salacion Town. Nope, no water. Celestic Town. I could battle people to the left. Towards Mount Coronet. That might help out a little bit. Um, There was no water by Bellstone. I don't think. Oh, you know what? Going down. Down Heart Home City. There's a bunch of little areas where you can surf and get items. Let me go do that. Plus, we can uh, redo. We can do some uh, battles we didn't get to do because it was too early. But now that it's nighttime, we can get some of those battles done. 
There we go. All HP, all EXP is good EXP. Yeah, they're gonna be a little under leveled though. But it's fine nonetheless. We still get to get our Pokemon leveled up and ready for the next bout. Alright, chop. Let's go ahead and go to Sean here. Even though Wally just needs one more battle. But, uh, we're going to get that battle out of the way later. Versus Barry! Now we don't want to pop over level 41 too much, so... He's good at 40 with almost EXP needed. Now let's go ahead and switch Garchomp to the front here. Right. Dive deep. Yes, sir. Alright, so we got some iron now. Our Pokemon will no longer be iron deficient. Alright, let's see here. Ooh, another one. Keeping an eye, my eyes open for crime. Anyone around arousing? Ooh, arousing. I'm not arousing suspicion. I'm arousing your wife. I mean, no, I'm not. Hoot Hoot is out here. Sharknado is also out here, though. I can't get over his little scream. Yeah. That's Sharknado right there. Hey, dude, what's the matter with you? What's the matter with you? Machop, prepare to die. That's not Dragon Claw. That's Super Saiyan Claw right there. Now, just hold on. I didn't say you were looking, Shady. Yeah. Better not, just because I'm Mexican and go around saying I'm shady. So I beat you in a Pokemon battle, then you want to double back and backpedal? You racist bastard. You racist bastard. You killed Kenny. Ooh, sunny day. You sunny day at night, because I can, because I can. I make the sun come out at night. Ooh, Rose Incense. You... And that's what I would put on my grass type Pokemon. If I had one! Sharknado. I ain't tired, buddy. My name's Sharky. Sharky boy. Oh, gotta go this way. Hopper. Let's enjoy a fierce battle in the chilling night wind. Brr, refreshing. Why do you gotta be so sus, my guy? Alright. Dragon Claw time! Hoot hoot! Goes down! Alright, now we got my chop coming in here. And Dragon Claw takes that thing down as well. Gaining some good levels here. Good EXP at least. I already battled them. Hey look, an item I missed. My legs are still so sore. Oh. Roselia, is that you? Come closer.
Joe found an elixir. You can't elix my balls, bitch. Whoa, what's with the hostility, my guy? Whether there are problems or not, or if crimes have been committed or not, I still go out on patrol. Petroleum jelly. Alright, who, who is our Pokemon of the night, apparently? Everyone here has a Hoot Hoot. Why they have a Machop, I have no idea. Do you think if a priest had a Pokemon, it'd be a Machop? <laughs> Just kidding! Alright, so down goes the Machop. You're a sick man! Let's go ahead and see what is happening in the mansion. Because remember, last time we got screwed, man. They were all like, oh my god, you know, it's eight moves, not five. Welcome. Here's the challenge. It's the five. Beating with the punk, with the punk, with the punk, Get a special thing. Pokemon, use the move. Uh, switching it now. The five made knockout exact turns challenge. Today's target is five. Would you like to try? Hell yeah! I could just click buttons, my guy. Oh yeah, this is gonna be easy. Earthquake, all these motherfuckers. We gotta do it in exactly five turns, and there's five people. So we gotta one shot everybody. Everybody gets fucked tonight. Oh, look at that one shot. Pink, green. I think it's pink, green. All I know is this one's green. I have a feeling they're gonna be like, can you guess the colors in order that they said they liked it? I'm gonna write at least that one down, so green. We'll figure out the missing color. That's two! Yellow! Look at all these colors! Look at this shit right here! Earthquake that mother! Look right there! First one was the Elena! Elena! Send out your Clefairy so I can kill it! Elena! My dear Elena! Before art thou get thy earthquake? I'm fucking ruining the foundation of this mansion right now. It's three earthquakes in a row! Or four. Yikes! Oh, yikes! Look at that perfect! About to be level 39! I swear to God, if she uses protect, I'm gonna beat the shit out of her. Oh, what a whore! Are you fluffy kidding me right now? Mmm. 
Alright, I'm gonna shoot that bitch in the face. I'm gonna go get my Glock. You wait there. Ooh, that's annoying! Fucking whore. I was able to one shot. I could one shot it. Fucking used Endure. That's cheap as fuck. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Soothe, though. You can go soothe my nuts in your mouth. Fucking slut. Oh, that's stupid and annoying. Why did none of the other ones use it? It would be the last fucking one. I didn't even know Clefairy got Endure. Jump off a bridge now. Oh my fucking god. Oh man, are you kidding me? Is it possible to fucking beat that challenge? Like, Jesus Christ. Endure. Wow. Okay, well. Glacian Town, there's no water between that. Oh, wait, you know what? Yes, there is. There is water, there is water in between that shit. already got that item okay so can't go that way I do know a spot we still haven't been to Neutralizer, another thing we don't need because we can't use it.
Fuego Iron Woodworks. In that grass right there. And then uh, you can get flamethrower in this uh, woodwork, uh, iron workshop. Woodwork, what an idiot. Alright, there we go. Get two weeper berries. Weeper in. Topsy berry. Topsy berry. Oh shit, you get Gastron on here too. Huh? Let's get a Magmar. Come on, Magmar. We already have a Buizel. Aw, oh, fuck off, dude. this thing up so it can be our capture mine be gone float so you had your chance I just want my magma. Wow. Well, I guess we're just gonna be running around here for a little bit. No. Oh, there's always this option. You know, this is actually not that bad. Because we can get a Magna Zone in this game. Holy shit. Woohoo! I mean, we already have an electric type Pokemon, though. But never hurts to have a backup one. Especially when it's good as Magnazone. It won't have a uh, ground resist like our current one, but at least it's uh, still type. We don't have a still type. Alright, let's go ahead and go with Magneto. Unless someone has a better idea, I'll change it later. Magneto for now. Because I'm very unoriginal. Right, let's go ahead and start making our way in here. I think there's a lot of fire type Pokemon in here. So let's go ahead and put Gashadon up first. Go this way. Yellow shard. So uh, the, there's also shards in here, which I'm gonna need because I, I I need I need the I need the moves, my guy. I work in a fiery foundry. You bet I'm hot and sweaty. Oh, well, that's not something you tell a ten-year-old, dude. And uh, also, I'm looking up 
the honey tree things because I want myself a uh, Paracross. I will make room on this team if I have to. Wait, why do I have no name up front? Shit. Well, guess it's gonna get a kill. Damn it. Taking up my EXP, no name. Alright, I guess this is Sean's time to shine. I'll go ahead and put him up front. There's a lot of fighting types It's going to seem to be here. Sabine, baby, one more time. Oh, baby, baby. Ow! Ow! The calcium. Good, too. Let's go ahead and use those before we get too high level. Boosted your special attack. Boosted your defense. Okay, so we can't go that way. Working our way through the valley woodwork. Working our asses on. Singing ourselves a sorry ass. Country song. Bleep, 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 bleep. That's all, folks. Well, it's not often we get a visitor. I like to go to. Let's mark the occasion with the battle. Sharknado, you needed. Damn, still tights. Earthquake, these motherfuckers. Another Magnemite, another Earthquake. And one more Magnemite. One more Earthquake! I guess I'm just gonna have to study the uh, hair cross trees later. shard which we needed we needed an extra blue shard for sure all right green shard wonderful so we go back that way They're gonna help us we gotta go this way yep 
I was like some Zelda crap. Jesus Christ. Study this real quick. Perfect. Ooh, rock incense. That's interesting. What would that could be for? Are you maybe getting annoyed by where the floor panels are taking you? No, I, I'm getting annoyed by the sound they're making. Where they're taking me is fine. Smack more! You ready to be taken down, my boy? Stop, babe. Ooh, that did not take it out. Now we'll get fire punched here, which is going to do really good damage, plus a burn, which is not good for us. But side beam will at least take it out now. Then we can heal up. We can heal up, not heal up. I'm going down in flames. <sighs> you said it, butter. Not me. Okay. There's heal there. Nope. No super potion? That's a yikes, my boy. And potions. Regular potions, I guess. For these. Let's get a full heal. Oh, on big on Sean. Come on now. There we go. Big Sean needs that burn heal. Spent too much time with that girl last night. TM 35 flame thrower, 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 thrower. Mr. Fuego. Well, hello. It's not often I get a visitor here. I tried to make the iron works run better with the moving floor tiles, but no one was happy about it. They said the floors made them dizzy, but you don't want to listen to me whine. Here's a souvenir. Star piece. Do you have any star pieces? You could trade them for... Yeah, you just gave me a star piece. Didn't you? Oh, I guess he didn't. I guess he's saying if we had star pieces. But I sold all mine. I didn't know you could do that. So that's annoying. Oh well. I think that was the last place you can go with Surf that you haven't yet. So we are all caught up on what we could do. Let's go ahead and fly, baby, fly! So, we just got a flamethrower. I mean, Natsu eventually learns it on its own. Um, let's go Thunderbolt. Let's check out when Wally learns something. No electric type move until level 50. And that's discharge. So I might just have to teach a thunderbolt. 
Um, let me see. Dang, Magneton doesn't learn it either? What's what, what's up with these Pokemon that are electric types not learning Thunderbolt? Naturally. Alright, so Charizard, let's see how far you are from getting a flamethrower here. Four more levels. Nah, we're not gonna. We're, not, we're, we're just gonna teach you flamethrower. <clears throat> yeah, we're just gonna teach it to you now. And we're just gonna teach Rotom Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt goes to Lucky Contestant number one. Shockwave, you're out of here. Our team just got that much stronger. Boom. Flamethrower. For Natsu. <clears throat> Sharknado, you are not about to learn Flamethrower. Get rid of Fire Fang. That's not going to help us in our Steel type gym. Alright, let's see. Toxic. Toxic on anybody? Let's see, Dawn? I guess over Harden. Look at that. Brine. Nope, not needed. Big. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> <clears throat> you know, and learn silver wind. Okay, I think we're good. Let's go ahead and go to the left. And finally advance. Yo, what were you thinking taking all those detours? I don't know, man. Let's try to be cool. Howdy, officer. <clears throat> Let's see. Let's go this way. Hyper Potion. Let's see who's going to lead us in this battle here. Let's go ahead and go done. Done was a good choice. We got hidden power rock. Hidden power. Get twister off on us. Okay, dragon rage just. Decent damage. Always does 40. Ooh, Ice Bang. Not doing shit. And we finally take down the Gyarados.
Alright, that was annoying. I'm just gonna go ahead and send out Wally. Wally's not gonna make an appearance for the next gym anyway, so even if it does go over level 41, it's not gonna be a problem. <clears throat> Wally's level 41, thanks to the Thunderbolt there. Man, that music is good. Alright, so we got Remory. That's something Sean can handle. So today, we beat a gym leader, we fought Cyrus, and we're making our way to the next gym. Once we get to the next city, uh, that's going to be it for today. Oh man, it's all good, Eddie. I understand, man. No harm, no foul. Gyarados goes down. Oh my goodness, this man has so many worthless Pokemon on his team. Oh, finally! Sean is level 40 and wants to learn Psychic. Bye, Psybeam. Now we're gonna be one shot motherfuckers right now. Woo, boy! You thought Psybeam was something. Yum, 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 yum. Woo! Gone. Like the wind. Gone like the wind. Yeah. Oh yeah. Texas tied it up two to two versus the Colorado Rockies. Get out of this place. Fight me, boy. Manti, the baby form of Manti. Worthless Pokemon, but so cute. I guess all baby Pokemon are worthless. Unless you're playing Little Cup. Macho. But even then, in Little Cup, there's much better Pokemon than the babies. Except for Elekid. Elekid's a beast. I don't care what anyone says. Battle rhythm, battle, battle rhythm. Either way, I'm 
switching to not so gonna go side I already know it X's are oh shit critical hit that definitely would have killed Alakazam time to go for flamethrower I wonder if anyone's actually used Bide in battle and it worked. Like a real person versus person battle. Time to see. Oh, you look puzzled. You're wondering who I am. I'm Professor Rowan Data, sister of Don's father. Uh, the professor asked that I upgrade your Pokedex. So I had chosen this spot on a hunch that you'd pass through. Joe, may I have your Pokedex for a moment? Good chunk. I've upgraded your Pokedex. I shall. I should explain how it's been upgraded. Shouldn't I? Whew, can't read. You can now display images of male and female Pokemon. Okay, I'll leave you to carry with your project for the professor. May I also ask you to keep an eye on Team Galactic. The professor is concerned about what happened in Jubilee City. It's probably nothing to worry over. I'll be on my way now. Boy, I sure am thirsty. Ah, Gen 1 reference. We are finally in the new town. Alright, so we gotta go Iron Island before we do the gym. And we'll go ahead and end this episode off on a banger. We're gonna battle Barry. Let's fucking go! Let's go! Get high in the... Shit! Please. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead. Put no name in the box. Um. I just want to have Giraffe Rig on the team, so I'm just gonna slap him on there. Not a real part of the team, but you know, just here. We're about to get Lucario. But for the big middle of the bridge showdown, showdown. Whoops! Hey Joe, 
You're going to town as a gym leader up past here, eh? Someone to check to see if you're ready for this challenge. That someone is me with my brand new badge. Tough this battle yet, guys. Thunderbolt. Bolt. Bolt. If you live this, you're too damn bulky. And you don't, Sir Raptor goes down. Wally is off to a hot start with that Thunderbolt. And now, uh, Eddie's about to send out Heracross. So, what will Joe do here? Oh, he's switching now. And Natsu is coming out, the Flying Fire type. Heracross is still menacing as hell. And, oh, looks like the Charizard's going for the fly. Heracross goes for Night Slash, but misses because Natsu's in the air. Natsu comes back down and hits the fly on the Heracross. Down that thing goes. Four times effective. Natsu gets some nice EXP there to get ready for the gym challenge. All right, Empoleon is coming in. What will Joe do here? And Don is the answer, it seems. Empoleon comes out looking royal, like the god of the sea he should be. Don's quick claw is popped off, though, and Mud Bomb goes off into Empoleon. And does not do half. Empoleon's Bubble Beam hits Don and does a decent chunk, about a fifth damage. Empoleon outspeeds this time, thanks to the Quick Claw not popping off. And now Don is sitting at just above the half, while Empoleon gets hit by another Mud Bomb that does more damage, but does not lower accuracy. Does not heal up here. Does not heal up here, and he got he got a high roll on that bubble beam. That was scary as hell. I thought Don was about to go down there, but Don pulls it through and much bomb that the the Napoleon, and it's over. Roserade's coming in now. What will Joe go to here? Eddie, I never get six old son. I don't know where you heard that from. <laughs> All right, time. Sean goes for the Psychic, and Roserade is not going to take that very well, being a poison type, and it doesn't live it at all. Roserade goes down. EXP goes off into Sean's bar like white on rice and a paper plate in a snowstorm. Level up for him. Rapidash is coming out now, and it looks like pretty much all of Joe's mons are coming to the party. Now that Sharknado is making an appearance. Rapidash coming out elegant as hell. We've gotten our we've gotten out of tougher spots than this plenty of times. Well, we'll see if uh, Eddie's quote really lives up to it. David, nah. All fun and games there. He he's never beat me seriously. All right, here we go. Rapidash is looking determined. But Sharknado has Earthquake. Rapidash is faster and gets that takedown. But Sharknado uses that Earthquake. Live in it, no problem. Can Rapidash take the pounding? It does not appear so, and Rapidash goes down. Sharknado gets that EXP quite nicely, and Eddie is defeated. Yeah, yeah, you're just a bit better than me as usual, but listen up. Let me tell you who's going to take on the Pokemon League and become champion. You guessed it. Right, it's gonna be me! Anyways, you should go to Iron Island and toughen up some more. Yeah, train at Iron Island. That's what did it. That's what I did before going to the gym. And my repair wore off at a perfect time right there. So now...
play with switch on you would have lost at least one mod in this battle oh with the switch off yeah i don't do that that's that's for uh high 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 tier nuzlockers i i am not that i need my switches <clears throat> But look, I'm saving. I'm saving. So if something happens, uh, there shouldn't be an excuse. Because this, this thing's saved. And we'll be back on this game tomorrow. <sighs> tomorrow we will be exploring the Iron Islands. And doing the gym badge. And possibly getting a second gym badge as well. Uh, facing Candice. Uh, the Ice Gym Leader. Saving twice. Fuck that shit. And, uh, yeah, guys. Thank you for watching. Eddie, specifically you for chatting with me. I really appreciate the, the, the conversation. And, yeah, guys, that's all I have for tonight. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.